Coach Carrie and Alex here going over tomorrow's workout. Hi guys. Our warm up is going to start with a minute of dub wonders. And then we're going to do half pigeon. You guys can drop to the floor. We want that front shin perpendicular to your body. Uh, get a good stretch on there, both sides. I'm going to hop up and do a deep lunge. Sorry, it's not fully up. Oh. Deep lunge stretch. Stretch out those hips, hit both sides. We're going to stand up and do splits with a forward fold. So splitting our feet and then folding forward, trying to get low to the ground, push those hips back, stretch, stretch out those adductors. If you guys can, get down your forearms, awesome. And you guys are going to go into lateral lunge. So bring the feet in a little bit, stretch them out, go into a wide uh, stance, lateral lunge, keeping that chest up. 10 total. We're going to do 10 hands overhead squats. So just like we're doing overhead squats, hands overhead, try and keep that chest up. Then we're going to do some kip swings. If you guys have a full brick available, you guys are going to do some kip swings. If not, you guys are going to do hollow rocks and superman. So going into that hollow rock, flipping it over for superman. And then toes to bar after that. So um, for toes to bar modification, you guys can do a V up. All the way back, all the way up. Try to touch the shoelaces. And then next, we're going to go over our barbell stuff. So you guys are going to grab your bar. Go ahead and get it on your back and go into a wide grip. Get that bar overhead. We're going to first start off with five overhead squats. So thinking about active shoulders, pull that bar apart, nice big chest, armpits forward, knees out, tight core. Um, and then we're going to bring it forward uh, in front for Bergner. Um, working on either power or pull. We'll get you guys set up for full snatch. So starting mid shin, keeping that bar close, pulling it in the hips, going up into that shrug. We do want you guys to have that triple extension of the ankles, the hips, and the knees. You guys are going to do a shrug and a pull. So shrug and then pull, elbows are high and outside. And then we'll do a couple power snatches, getting under that bar, getting that bar over our shoulders safely. And then we'll follow it through with a full snatch. So putting it all together, making sure you're shrugging, pulling, and then getting under that bar for that full snatch. Okay, so strength, we are in our second week of snatch. Uh, again, you guys are doing this for six weeks. You can choose power or you can choose squat, but you guys need to do five singles working up to 70 to 80% of either your one rep max or of effort. So Alex is showing you both the power and pull. Once you get to that working weight, you guys are knock out four singles at that weight. You've got a good 20 minutes here. For those who are at home, we're going to have you guys do five sets. You're going to start off with five sumo del high pull with that dumbbell or kettlebell. And then you're going to do single arm overhead lunge. Get that bell or dumbbell or a kettlebell overhead. You do five on your right arm, five on your left. So you're going to do those two uh, movements five times. And then you're going to go into three sets of five, uh, a single arm dumbbell full snatch. So from the, from the ground, pulling that bar or bell into your hips, shrugging, pulling, and then stabilizing over your shoulder. So that's our strength. This is leading us into our last week of our CrossFit Chateau Open workout uh, competitions. It's been so much fun. We've had so much fun. We'll probably just keep doing these every week. But 16.2, so 2016, this is the second week uh, workout. You guys are going to do four minutes to start. It's one time through. You're going to do 25 toes to bar. So Alex is going to show you 25 V-ups. After the 25 toes to bar or V-ups, pop up. 50 double unders. Knock out those double unders or single unders. And then you go right into 15 squat cleans. So full clean. So hands are right outside the shins, pulling that bar into our hips, getting under it, catching in that front squat, standing up. So 15 squat cleans out of lighter weight. If you complete within four minutes, uh, you're going to add weight to that bar. And then the next section, you're going to do again 25 toes bar, 50 double unders. And then 13 full cleans at that heavier weight. If you get done within a lot of time, which is now eight minutes for those two, you can add another four minutes to the clock, add a little bit of weight, and keep going. So the kicker here is if you finish, let's say your first four minutes, and you get done in two minutes, you get to add four minutes, but you get to keep going. You don't need to wait for your four minutes. Now you get to just keep on going. Other kicker here is if you are in your first four minutes and you only got your 14 squat cleans, essentially you're done. That is your score, which is going to be your score for this workout. However, we want you guys all to keep working out. So just notate like when you actually complete or you are 
run out of time, that's your actual score for this workout. Uh, but we do want you guys to keep moving. So keep going through the workout the best you can for that full 16 minutes. Um, this is an awesome, fun workout. Definitely shows us where our weaknesses are. Maybe it's the cardio, maybe it's the weight that you clean. It's tough um, one. It, it's very tough, yeah. For the toes to bar, we definitely do not want you doing 15 and then you're like barely able to get one. It's very easy to lose that um, that strength from that, that hollow to Superman to get the feet up. So making sure you guys do just short little sets if you need to. So if you're doing sets of five or singles, whatever you need to do just to keep that good hip swing. Um, squat clean, you might go close to unbroken on that first set, maybe. But um, on this one, typically you want to be doing like small sets as well. So sets of three and then maybe dropping down to singles. So anywho. Share these workouts with, you, with your friends, subscribe to your YouTube channel, um, and we're gonna keep going with the workout. <laughs> body weight, I forgot. Body weight complete, round of 25 V-ups, 50 double unders, eight single leg deadlifts. So no weight, you drop down and touch that floor, eight per side, and then 12 jump squats. Four rounds of that, you guys can do that basically for 16 minutes. So that's your workout, um, what else we got? These uh, CrossFit open workouts have been super fun. We're gonna try and still keep programming some fun workouts like that, competitive workouts each week for you guys on Wednesdays. It's something to look forward to. Um, we are also going to be looking at doing some kind of weight loss challenge or um, of some sort. So we're gonna be working on that for you guys. So take take time to like maybe like start getting ideas. I don't know, actually I was not gonna say that. What I was going to oh. say was um, <laughs> make sure that you are kind of like on Facebook and watching that and we'll be posting that soon. So we love you guys. We hope you have a wonderful week. Weather's been awesome and get in here and get this workout done tomorrow. All right? Bye guys. Bye guys, love you.